All right. So now, in the very distant future of the universe, the black holes that did eat whatever it was they were going to eat right. will ultimately evaporate in what's called Hawking radiation. Okay. So the black hole becomes undone, and all that matter that was in the black hole is now back scattered into the scattered back into the universe. So now, if you do the math and ask how much mass is there within the radius of the known universe, and see how that compares to a black hole's mass and size, it turns out the entire universe can be analogized to being a black hole unto itself with a horizon beyond which you cannot see. Wow. So it is not completely crazy to think of the universe and all that's going on within it as containing a black hole that has all the external properties that any black hole we're looking at would have within us, within our universe. Okay. So then you ask, if we are a black hole, are we a black hole in some larger universe? That's what I was about to say. So who's to say that there's not more universes with the same black hole that we would be? Correct. This is what, this is what led to the idea that maybe black holes are portals to entire other space-time continuum. 